expanding the content on World War II Wendell today. We're doing a little exploration video. We're looking for Ingersby Tunnel, a disused railway tunnel built in the early 1880s. Now, Ian is our resident steam train expert, aren't you, Ian? Yes. And which way is the tunnel? Where's the portal? This way. This way. Lead the way, Ian. Lead the way. Beef has got wet feet because he's just fell in a brook. Silly boy. We found it then. It took us about two hours because we went to the wrong end first of the tunnel that's all filled in. Look at this. It's getting late in the day. On the way then, on the trap bed, Callum's found this. Show us what you found, Cal. So it's a white thing. So it's an, it's an old insulator. But this is a good one because it says LNER on it just there. Damaged though, so unfortunately, no good. Right then, here's the tunnel. Who's going first then? I I'll volunteer as tribute. Have you got a torch? I don't bring a torch. Yeah, you got my phone. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be the leader. I get to go first. Ian, oh. check this out. Yeah, what do you think of that? <laughs> Another Christmas right. present from my dear wife. Thank you very much. But Ian, I'm feeling really light-headed. <laughs> you know, I've brought you all yeah. this way to this tunnel just to do that one joke. Let's go home now. No, <sighs> cool. we're going in. You're not the last. Yeah. Right, don't like that. Going in. I feel the wind coming. Feel quiet. It's like a, a troll's a troll's lair, isn't it? Ain't. Great, thank you. What are you thinking then, Ian? I like it. I love it. I love it. So it's about, what are you saying, 12, 15 metres high? Yeah. I'm going to have to film you because I don't think anything else is going to pick up with a light. This was the Great Northern and the London North Western line then. Joint line, weren't it, Ian? Yes. Yeah, from Leicester Belgraph Road to Marfield Triangle. And this is the train that would have took us to Skeggy back in the day, isn't it, Ian? Oh, to the it seaside. Is. It is. And what you found there then? I found a refuge. A refuge. And explain what that is. Well, like on the other videos, like on the Pack Horse Bridges, you had refuge. And obviously when the train would come in, you'd get in, a group of you, a load of men, and then just get in and tuck in while the train went whizzing by. Yeah, if you were working on the track or you got caught in the tunnel for any reason, you jumped in there and you were nice and safe. What's Callum found? Hey, Simpsons. Cotton. Nice. Yeah, there's been a few fires going on in there. That's a good comic as well. Da, 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 da. Let's do Callum's comments. What you got for us this week, Cal? <laughs> um, if you want more of these like tunnel kind of exploring kind of videos, comment down below. Oh, exploration videos, yeah. Exploration. Yeah, we enjoy it. Urbex. Don't we? Urbex. I give myself down there. Thank you very much. Comment down below. Callum's comments. Well done. So we're just coming up to the first air vent then that is directly above us now. As we say, it's a bit late in the day, so I'm sure all you can see is a little hole. Yeah, what's that in? About 20 metres? Yeah. 25 metres? Yeah. Interesting. Let's carry on the walk. We're about 150 metres in, 200 metres in. Yeah. Right that way. Ian's just found some on the wall then. What you found, Ian? Tell us where it is. This is for your wires. That's so for your wires? The tunnel. Ah, so that's why these run all the way up one side. There's another one just here. I know it's a bit dark, sorry, but yeah. One There's there. hundreds of them in here, isn't there? One there. Yeah, about a metre spread apart. Probably an old yard. Yeah? Yeah. Very good. Old sign there, unfortunately, graffitied up. We'll never know what it said. Will we, Cal? No. No? Oh. Are you enjoying this? Yeah, it's all right. We're about 300 metres in now. Beef has asked to turn around about three times. Oh, shit, Uncle Ian's loving it, isn't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like Let's keep walking. Yeah. It's your echo. Yeah. So we figured out the refuges are about... What are they in? Every 10 or 15 yards, isn't they, in this yeah. one? There's a nice big double one here, look. And that tells us the end is 150 yards. That way. So you've only got 150 yards to go, Beef. He's not enjoying this today, bless <laughs> him. This, this ain't his stuff. Yeah. yeah, that's what yes. I said, that way. Point 150 that yards. End. Yeah, that's what I just said. Thanks, Cal, for your input. Oh, yeah. Why is it all shining? That's, that's all the soot and everything, ain't it? That's back, mate. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Another refuge just here then, and as you can see, 1998. So that's 21 years ago now, and we've just found these. These were in fact the hide and seek champions, 1998. Well done, Yeo and Hyde. <laughs> So we've come as far as we can then. We're about 300, 350 metres in. It starts to slope upwards and get very wet underfoot. We know it probably ain't the best video we've ever made, but we've had a bit of fun, haven't we? Ian? Oh, we have. And it's another choo choo train thing for you? Yeah. Another one off your list? World War II, Wendell, we're underground. Right, let's go back. <laughs> Beef bobbing himself. Here's the view right at the end of the tunnel then. As you can see, the other portal's been backfilled, so no way through. There you go, World War II Wendell. A little bit of underground, a bit of urbex. Train tunnels. Don't forget Callum's comments. We'll see you next time. World War II Wendell, like and subscribe. Thanks for viewing. Tell your friends.